Welcome back to the channel. It's October 14th, 2023. 76 years to the day of the first supersonic flight performed by Captain Charles E. Yeager in the Bell X-1 over the skies of Edwards Air Force Base, California. Um, we got a special video today of the model flying last weekend at Edwards Air Force Base off of the dry lake bed, which is actually where I learned how to fly models as a kid back in the early 90s. So it's a very special place to me. Lots of great memories there with my dad. And it was really neat to see the X-1 flying over the skies of Edwards Air Force Base once again after all these years. This might be the first X-1 model to have flown ever at, at, at Edwards Air Force Base. I'm not 100% sure on that, but it's a decent guess. <laughs> but uh, anyways, we got there before sunrise, got some killer pictures of the airplane, um, had a great day flying it, just performed amazing. Um, we did break the scale sound barrier so we have a GPS unit in the airplane which provides telemetry through the IX-20 and it did um, on every flight reach speeds over 125 miles an hour which is about a scale of Mach 1.1 to 1.2 or so so that was pretty cool um, we took it to the X-1 loading pit which is where the real X-1 was loaded onto the B-29 there's pictures of that in here uh, just a super special day Really cool to see the X-1 flying out there at Edwards Air Force Base. It made it really special. So, hope you guys enjoy the video of it flying. Uh, special thanks to my son, who took all the video for me and helped take take some of the pictures. And, uh, yeah, it was just a great day with my son and my dad and the X-1 out there on the lake bed. So, super special location, special model, great day. I hope you guys enjoy the video. There will be more flight videos coming from this day in the next week or so but uh, enjoy these clips of the airplane flying and uh, we'll see you in the next one
time remaining 2 minutes.